Alright, alright. I haven't done a talking video in a bit, but I decided, fuck it, why not? Because something just happened to where I'm like, I gotta make a video on this. So we'll get straight into it. So this is my, uh, about a week or two ago, I was sick. And it didn't turn into asthma like it normally does, which was good. But I was, I was crook, okay? I, I wasn't able to go to work. So, and that was on Sunday. So I had Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday off. You know, long, long break. So I was back on Thursday. First thing, first thing is, bro, the first day at work always feels like crap, okay? You, for me at least. You know, I'm always like, the first day, you're kind of just getting... Your chak you know, you're getting like your chakra into balance and all that, you know, you're kind of just, you're kind of just feeling everything out. You know, after like an hour or two, I feel good and I can just, you know, go through the day, go through the week easy. But, you know, I'm coming back on my first day from being sick and it's the first day of the week. I'm like, ah, oh, fuck man. I hope this day is going to be good. So I pull into the car, but you know how it is pulling, you know, with the Lamborghini, all that shit, you know pull in park up and i'm like okay hopefully my co-workers here and you know there's not too many pallets today walk in sign in using the app because i clock in and clock out you know i clock you know for um for work is for an app so i clock in walk to the back open up the freezer and fridge to see how many pallets we got i looked okay okay good 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 now, by this time, I'm thinking, it's my co-worker. Because she's usually there before me. She's usually there before, you know, before or just as I'm getting there. She's usually never after me. And I only came, like, maybe three or f four minutes before, you know, before my actual shift started. Barely, you know, early. So I was like, oh, I wonder if she's just late. Nah. I just didn't have a co-worker for that day. So I'm like, well, fuck. Okay. No, 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 we, we, we're good. I, I could deal with this. Okay, okay, okay. No co-worker. You know, my manager called me up and said, yeah, sorry. She's not coming in. I'm like, fine, 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 fine. Okay, 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 okay. Got to do the pallets. Got to just, I just got to get through this by myself. Second thing that pissed me off. They had, bro, they had the AC on blast. They had it on blast the highest heat. I think you could have it. It, bro, it was giving me the massive migraines and headaches. I'm there like, bro. Like, uh, do, are we having camels coming through our fucking, like, uh, our store? Why, why is there so much heat exuding out of this supermarket? Bro. I, I, I felt like an ice cream, bro. I was melting. I was, I, I didn't think I was going to make it. A bit dramatic, but it felt like I wasn't going to make it, all right? It felt like it. So anyway, anyway, anyway. No co-worker. It's hot as shit. I'm like, okay, okay. Okay. That's all right. I got to go for the rest of this day. I'll be fine. Come to like maybe, let's say... Two or three hours later, bro, I get like so many, just a wave of dickhead customers. Just the whole wave, and I'm like, oh, brother, like, if you don't shut the fuck up, get out of my face, and just get your shitty stores so I can go back home. Like, I can't wait for you, cuzzies, to fuck out of the store. Like, you think I actually give a shit? I don't give a damn. Fuck you. Fuck y'all. Suck your nan. I'm there just like, oh my lord, bro. I'm I'm gonna go jump off a clip it jump off a clip in a second. Cause he's just I'm like mm. like usually there's never customers that piss me off, but I'm like bro today was just different. I don't know. Maybe it's cause I had it, you know AC blasting. Bro, these headaches were so bad. I was coughing because it felt like there was no fresh air. I'm like, ah oh, this is Sucking ass, but suck my ass with all this shit. And I'm like, these customers aren't helping, but I'm like, I can get past that. I can get past that. So, fast forward another two, three hours. So it's around, I think, 11 p.m. by this point. I started at five, so it's like six hours in around that time. Six hours, six hours in, and I'm like, 
Okay, I need to go toilet, you know. I need to go take a shit. I need to go piss. Let's go do that. So I go in, do my business. <laughs> I go to get up. And guess what? My phone, the slippery snake bastard that it is. I go to get up. My phone slips out my pocket. It drops. I hear it go. Psh, okay. On something that sounds like kind of hard, kind of like concrete, you know, marble. And I'm like, oh my God, did I like, please don't tell me, you know, I dropped my phone. It's got a crack. It didn't get a crack. All right. It didn't, it didn't get a crack. You want to know why it didn't get a crack though? Because, uh, lo and behold, I get up, look, my phone has fallen into the toilet. My phone has fallen right into the toilet, directly in the middle. And you know what else is bad? It was still the teeniest piece of shit in like, in like the water. So the water was like brown. It was still shit water. I'm like, oh my God. I'm there just like, bro, there's no way I have to fucking grab. I can't flush it or so my phone's gone. So I had to fucking get like my hand in there to go grab my phone. Luckily enough, I flush because like I flush before, you know, I finish. Because, you know, you don't want to clog the toilet whenever I go for a number barrel. When I, when I go for a shit barrel, it's a shit. So I end up going, I'm, I'm kind of thankful I, I, I flushed it before. Because if I had to, if all of it was in there, like it might have landed on top of the, you know, toilet paper. But probably wouldn't have. I would have had to literally fish my phone out of actual shit. Those are like the teeniest people. But um, but like that day was so weird and so annoying. Like I was, the day was shit. I can't lie. That whole day was so annoying. That day went on for so long. It felt like years. It felt like years this day was going on. Pissed me off. Like make sure to tell me if you guys like had any similar like experiences. There's, there's gotta be people with, um, there's definitely people with some experiences tell me like tell me what happened on your one of your like um bad days it's you know it's funny and good to hear good to get out of yourself good to just put it out to the world and be like yeah my phone fell into shit water anyways hope you guys enjoy the rest you know rest of your day rest of your night wherever you are peace